Did you ever read the book version of Babe the Sheep Pig? It's not as good as the movie. So I was helping a friend move across country, which time exactly, one of the times, and we stopped somewhere outside Cincinnati, had donuts at Tim Hortons. My friend, she's pretty easygoing about a lot of things. And for some reason though, when she looked at herself in the drop down mirror, you know, in the the, the visor, the sun shield, whatever that thing is called. I'm sure anyone who knows anything about cars could tell me what it's called. And she couldn't believe how ridiculous she looked. I said, it's, you know, it's great. Like you're just, you're, you're letting it out. You're processing. I don't know what I said to her. All I knew was that I wanted donuts and coffee, which we got. And she had had this amazing nap, which is part of why her hair looked the way it did. She said, I feel like a newborn. I feel so refreshed. And so she took the next leg of driving, I think, and I had a donut or two and some coffee. We were heading down the road through Kentucky. I don't even know, I really don't even know where we were except on the border of Cincinnati and Kentucky. And then later we were further into Kentucky than when we started. People were driving in a way that was bonkers. And my friend started cursing like a sailor. And we started laughing because she went from being a newborn to cursing. And we had several hundred more miles to think about this and talk about it. And we've had several years to think about it and talk about it. And we've come to this thing that might sound formulaic, which it isn't, but we're just going to hypothesize this. When you've sloughed off a whole bunch of dead skin when you've sloughed off a whole bunch of weight you've been carrying, when it's been purged from your body one way or another, psychically, physically, and you're like a newborn, you have this tender skin and these wide open eyes and all you want to do is sleep and cry and, and eat and laugh and maybe more emphasis on the crying and eating than on the laughing. And it makes sense to want to curse people because you have this fresh skin, because you're looking at the world anew and other people are still in their patterns and there's friction. <laughs>